Hello, my dear viewers. This video is for those of you who have decided to build a 4K gaming PC with NVIDIA graphics cards. In my opinion, uh, to take full advantage of playing latest games on ultra settings at 4K resolution, you need at least uh, two GTX 980 Ti's or two Titan X's and that is what I've tested today and I'll share the results with you to give you a general idea of what kind of FPS you should expect from these two very similar graphics cards but that will come at the end of this video. Uh, from my previous test we know that 6 gigabytes of video memory on 980 Ti two-way SLI is enough to run games at reasonable frame rates on ultra settings uh, where we used FXAA or 2XMSAA but it is not suitable for people who want to go for three or four-way SLI and crank up AA settings to 4X or 8X or maybe even use resolution scaling option uh, where it is available in this case, 6 gigabytes is simply not enough in games like Assassin's Creed Unity and Shadow of Mordor because when you hit 7 gigabyte memory usage requirement, 980 Ti stops working completely until you lower those settings. Here you can see how GTX 980 Ti failed in Assassin's Creed Unity and dropped frame rate to 3 FPS when Titan X managed to utilize over 11 GB of memory and keep the game running. But the truth is that we don't know if in near future we will see uh, similar games that need so much video memory. So I can't say that Titan X is more future proof, but it sure is the best option for those of you who want to go for three or four way SLI. In conclusion, I will say this. If you want a good and reasonably priced 4K gaming PC, then you, your choice should be GTX 980 Ti two-way SLI with some aftermarket cooling like EVGA's ACX 2.0 or Asus Strix. Factory overclock on those models will match performance of stock Titan X. But if you want to build a PC with custom water cooling, overclock it to the maximum and do some extreme 4K gaming, then two, three or even four way SLI Titan X should be your number one choice because it, can, it will handle anything that you will throw at it. Well now enjoy some side by side com FPS comparison of 980 Ti versus Titan X. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Comment below to let me know which card would you choose. And until next time, RG out.